Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for our June 2021 tarot reading. And this will be for the sign of Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers, the highest good of all. Beginning of the month, I'll take a card from the top. Middle of the month, I'll take a card from the center. And the end of the month, I'm going to take a card from the bottom. Okay, and let's see what we have here, Leo. We begin the month with the death card, okay? And the death card doesn't necessarily mean a physical death. A lot of people get scared when they see that card thinking, oh my goodness. No, actually, it's a beautiful card. The death card tells you that you're entering into a new chapter in your life. You're closing out an old chapter and you're beginning a new chapter. You're about to enter a brand new phase in your life. And we all need to go through this because if we keep rereading the, the last or current chapter in our life, it doesn't allow us to move on. So this is telling me that you're maybe leaving something behind, maybe an old way of thinking, an old way of living. Uh, whatever it is, it's a good thing because you're going to be entering into a new phase. Okay, ending an old phase and, and beginning a major change, major transformation for the better in the beginning of this month. And then in the middle of the month, we have the King of Swords. Now, the King of Swords may be a person in the middle of the month that you're dealing with, or it could be the energy or persona that you're going to need to take on in the middle of the month. This person could represent a military person, law enforcement, someone who's very logical in their thinking. He's not emotional like the King of Cups, okay? He's the kind of person that allows his logical thinking and logical brain to rule his decisions. So there may be something that you need to decide upon in the middle of the month where you're going to need to have this logical thinking and not allow your emotions to take over, okay? And this King is a very... Um, once he makes up his mind, he knows what he wants, he makes it up, and he moves forward. He's not wishy-washy. He's not emotional going back and forth. He's able to cut people out of his life, too, if he needs to with that sword, just like the Queen of Swords. These people are very direct and to the point. There's no nonsense with this person. So it's possible that, you know, maybe you're dealing with someone like this in the beginning or the middle of the month, rather. Or, like I said, you may have to take on the persona of this King of Swords and maybe make a logical decision on something that's coming up in the middle of the month. Um, and sometimes the King of Swords is a, seems very uh, detached, but he's the kind of person that you would go to if you need some good, solid advice, too. And then at the end of the month, we have the Three of Pentacles. Okay, so you're building upon something. The pentacles are our health, our wealth, and our finances. The pentacles are something that we work very hard for. And it seems at the end of the month, okay, you're getting recognition for something that you've worked on. Okay, um, this could be something you're doing personally yourself. This could be maybe getting recognized at work, at, you know, your, your office or your, your job site. Whatever it is, you're going to see at the end of the month some type of success, okay? You're going to feel that whatever work you're putting in, you're, you're becoming successful. It's going in the right direction and that you're achieving something uh, for the effort that you've put in, okay? So this card is revealing that through whatever hard work and effort, success is starting to show for you at the end of the month. So you know that it wasn't all for nothing. And you should be feeling a sense of great achievement at the end of the month as well. Um, maybe even getting a, a raise. Maybe you're going to be making more money uh, because you've become successful at whatever this is that you've been putting, you know, all of your hard work into. So it's a really solid way to end uh, the month of June. And what a very interesting month for you. If you've enjoyed this reading, please like it by giving it a thumbs up share it and above all subscribe because i will be back with more